everyone, welcome to another theatre vlog. Today I'm back at the Birmingham Hippodrome and we're going backstage at Matilda, which is very exciting. Uh, starting the vlog very quickly on the fly as we're going backstage because I forgot to start it before. So here we are. <laughs> um, I'm with Amy, who is very ill. Poor thing, wow. honestly, honestly. Um, and it's required the jinx. I'm always I'm ill when you're here. <laughs> no, it's been twice. Never hang up, hang up, hang out. <laughs> um, oh so we expect this space to be a black box, and we will basically kit everything out. So it takes three days to move the show and to put into a venue like this. Uh, we obviously have rehearsals with um, the cast and the crew and the local crew that we work with, all the local dresses, all the local staff. Uh, we have a full dress rehearsal before our first preview. And then uh, obviously we have our press night. The scale of that operation is massive. It's one of the bigger shows on the road. And um, the set is completely automated. And um, so um, it's, there's not very many shows out on the road on this scale that have a completely automated set. And we do that just to keep that vision and that beautiful look of the show um, that our designers and directors wanted. And we were very protective over that when we took the show on the road. And absolutely everything that happens on the stage, cast entrances, exits, lighting cues, automation cues, fly cues, absolutely everything is controlled by Spanner. So she's kind of the command control. So that's what all of those monitors and screens that you saw in the way in which you can take a picture of later if you like. Um, that's kind of where she sits. We have lots of CCTV on the show just to make sure all the children and everybody's standing in the right places because there's so many moving moving items. Uh, so that's Spanner and that is front corner. Um, so now we're going to take you on stage. variations that the designer came up with and um, so they're kind of stumbled in all over the place so you get that kind of 3d look but there's actually 160 different variations of those of those tiles I feel like I can't speak above this level. This is the stage of Yes, too dark. You can't see that. I'll show you a shot, but I need to Instagram this some of this. Yeah. Social media. I need to Instagram this. This is Andrew, by the way. Hello. Hello. We're now friends. We're gonna be in the vlog. Yeah, you are. You have to sign a form. Oh. <laughs> GDPR. <laughs> oh, they're actually squishy. Touch that. Ooh. Are we allowed to touch this? Yeah. Oh, oh my god. That feels, that feels. Why would eat that? <laughs> oh, my, oh my god, feel this one. Oh my god, stop it. This is so oh. funny. Jelly's really wobbly. Imagine well. if they're like, yeah, that's real. <laughs> Oh my god, that is, so wow, realistic. that looks delicious. Oh, oh, don't touch it. Don't <laughs> they look well realistic. Oh, you can't see because of my shadow. Crazy. Look at those chips, those crisps even, I am British. They do not look real. Ooh, so <laughs> yummy. Yeah. Is it? It's not moving, is it? It's not even moving. Oh my god, can't even try. Spoilers. The iconic ribbon. What is this? I think they were like bills. I don't know if I can. What is it? 
Yeah. They are, they're literally all... I bet it's for the chokies. <laughs> Probably, <yeah. laughs> That's amazing, they're so detailed. got laid out is their first quick change so after miracle mm. they will leave the stage run in here and there'll be a team of wardrobe staff who will do <coughs> their quick changes I am now home but I wanted to finish off this vlog by saying a massive thank you to the teams at the Birmingham Hippodrome and Matilda the Musical for inviting me to go backstage at the touring production which is currently at the Birmingham Hippodrome for the rest of the summer. This is a massive bucket list thing for me. The only thing that could have made it even more incredibly exciting is if they had the swings down and I could have had a go on those. That's been on my bucket list since I saw the show for the first time to be honest but no it was incredible getting to have a close-up look at the props to go on the stage and oh my god it was just amazing so thank you so so much I love Matilda the musical it's one of my absolute favorites so to have this opportunity is honestly mind-blowing I <laughs> I can't go over it, I might cry. <laughs> I had the best time, not only being on the stage and getting to experience that, but you know, seeing some of the costumes up close, getting to talk to some of the wardrobe and costume department, which was just so much fun, and like seeing all the details that go into this show. Getting to touch the fake food, which felt so bizarre, it was hilarious, and just getting to learn a bit more about the show. I've said this a million times, but it's one of my favorite shows, so any opportunity that I have to get to know more about a show I love, I am thrilled about. If you haven't seen Matilda the Musical then what are you playing at? You need to see it. It's on in London at the Cambridge Theatre and as I mentioned it's playing at the Birmingham Hippodrome until the 8th of September. I will link their website down in the description box so if you're not near Birmingham you can see if the tour is coming near you and if it is then you 100% need to see it. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more of me in the future. I hope you're all doing really well and I will see you in my next video. Bye.